Hi, this is Linda with LL Creation Studio. I've got a little uh, journal that I wanted to share with you today. Her name is Flight. I'm still on the hippie names of the 60s and 70s. She's a 5 by 7 uh, fabric co covered and she's got 160 pages, four signatures. She is hardcover. Uh, and uh, she is echo dyed uh, on cloth so it's fabric covered and I have done echo dyeing uh, with some leaves and ferns and little cute little butterflies and some a few little insects and um, on the front she has a little cheesecloth a black label underneath the cheesecloth and then she has this uh, painted two-tone brass and silver dragonfly right there and that's where she gets her name flight and along with everything else it's a more of a garden uh, journal on the outside she's got some uh, printed sorry silk that has been sewn together in a lace fashion gathered fashion fashion and sewed on right here and then she's got a uh, Tim Hope's uh, message band. It says life is has boundaries but imagination is boundless uh, printed on that. And then she's got Tim Holt's little name plate here that you can insert uh, your name or whatever you want to call uh, flight uh, the journal. And she has a Tim Holt's uh, vintage knob right here. Her sorry silk is a tie. It's the same print that's throughout the uh, journal and it just you take it and you can wrap one around or both around her and then just do it like that or you can tie it and <clears throat> there's a different ways that you can work with it. I left it extra long for you and you can see she's got a little two inch spine and she has the hidden uh, spine there's no <coughs> pardon me no uh, signatures being shown the sewing. She's got her uh, standard support here of the cheesecloth for the spine. And then on the back, she, like I said, she's just all of the echo dyeing is the patterns that I physically, everything has been uh, printed on here by hand, by me. And so let's take a look inside to see what Flight has to offer. And she has a uh, the uh, craft, craft text spine here that I've painted to go with more of a, uh oh, now you're back in, uh, more of the craft text that's been painted in an earth tone. And then she has this beautiful red and yellow polka dot by Bo Bunny, uh, a pocket there. And then she has the birds. And this is, uh, I got this off of Etsy. Debbie is the artist's name, uh, and I'll come up with it sometimes during the presentation. And I'll list her link uh, below where you can get this uh, pattern uh, journal kit. And it's all about mushrooms and birds, and and you got this nice sized pocket there, and a little journaling card that I made, uh, like a little. Uh, journal and you can write in it or put it in your purse and then put it back it's cute uh, and then a stamping of the butterfly graph paper cardstock and then more of that paper and then this is a scanned in <coughs> pardon me it is really allergy time here in Kentucky of the echo uh, printing that we've scanned in and, and made uh, paper out of it. Everything has been edged in uh, coffee distressed ink, lime paper, naturally you got your coffee stain paper, little frog stamping. Signatures, uh, this is where I sewed it in. There is no large envelopes in, in her. So this this is where you see where I have uh, sewn in the signatures 
and lime uh, paper. A nice uh, tag. My hands don't want to move today. More butterfly, a little bee. This paper is just beautiful. I mean, it's the mushrooms and birds, I think, is her uh, title of it. Echo printing again. This is the uh, mixed media paper. Little pockets. A little beetle. So mainly all of the stamps or garden uh, are related to uh, this type of birds and mushroom garden. And again another one of her uh, mushroom tags that come with the stamps. And all of them have the sorry silk matching, sorry silk, the black and the red. I think I said before it's 160 pages. She seems like it's more than that. Uh, it's just a lot of writing spaces. And a little snail up here at the top. Little mushroom stamp. Little grasshopper. This is a <clears throat> a different type of music paper. Printed the lines on that side. And the back is identical to the front. And if you're not familiar with Craft Text, what Craft Text, it's a, a man made fabric. Uh, that's not a fabric and it's not a paper. I don't, uh, it is sturdier than paper for sure and it's as sturdy if not more sturdy than uh, fabric. It won't wear and tear very nicely for you and then you've got the fabric on this side. you got a nice beautiful flat spine and it's all been edged in the coffee edging. And so this is Flight Four Signatures uh, she's got plenty of room for you to expand. She's five and a, and a quarter by seven and 160 pages. So thank you for stopping by today and uh, let me know what you think about flight. And uh, thanks for stopping. Talk to you later. Bye-bye.